Hi everyone, welcome back or welcome if you're new. I'm Julianne and today's a video. We have so much cleaning we're gonna be getting done. I have a short amount of time. So this is going to be a quick and efficient clean with me. I had a list of things that I wanted to complete and I only had about like an hour or two to get them done. So first we are gonna be starting out in the kitchen. I feel like that's the task that always takes the longest. So I do like to start in here and we're gonna get everything picked up off the island, which is just a catch-all space. Let me know in the comments if you're here for the cleaning motivation or if you're cleaning with me, and thank you so much for being here today. Everything that needs to go upstairs, I'm going to put in this box. So now that I have the kitchen picked up, I am going to move on to the dishes. And if you only have an hour or two to get your cleaning done, I suggest making a list. Today I had a list. I knew exactly what I wanted to do. And typically when I do a quick clean, I wouldn't like wipe down the cabinets or the appliances. But that was on my to-do list for today. So I wanted to make sure I got all that checked off. And if you have a short amount of time to get your cleaning done, I highly suggest um, just cleaning one area at a time completely clean the kitchen and then move on to something else having the kitchen completely clean will um, motivate you to get to those other areas and like I said the kitchen is always the hardest area for me it just seems to take the most time so getting that task done I always feel so much better just moving on to the other areas To clean the sink, I am using the Dawn Power Wash and I suggest that, like whenever you're trying to get a quick clean in or you just really want to minimize your time doing your cleaning, I suggest getting the Dawn Power Wash and a multi-purpose cleaner. The Dawn Power Wash you can use on multiple different areas. You can use it on your sink, your countertops. Um, for the stovetop, it does a great job. And I also suggest getting some microfiber cloth towels. I just don't like using a bunch of paper towels and I do think it minimizes your time when you're trying to get your cleaning done. So I should have taken these knobs off of the stovetop, but I wasn't 100% sure how to do it. I'm going to have to YouTube it and next time I will take them off. looks so much better. The Dawn Power Wash does an amazing job.
Alright, so now I'm quickly going to wipe down the countertops. We're not going to be moving everything. And if you're getting in a quick clean, you just don't have a lot of time, do what is important to you. Like if you want to move everything and that's what's important to you, then go ahead and move everything. But for me on this day, I had other things that I really wanted to get done and just moving everything out of the way definitely wasn't the top of my list. So I could see some spots on the cabinets and I really wanted to get them wiped down and I am just using a microfiber cloth towel with some Dawn Power Wash. I love the microfiber cloth towels. I think they work amazing and I love that I can just use them on all different surfaces. And if you have some tips and tricks for quick cleaning, make sure to leave them in the comments. The fridge was looking pretty bad so I am going to use the Wayman stainless steel cleaner and a microfiber cloth towel. Last week I had mentioned that the mailman had delivered my coffee maker to the wrong house. It got rained on while well, my new one finally got here and I'm so excited to get it put together. And I'm not sure if I made my coffee correctly. I think I might have accidentally pressed the wrong button. Um, but it still came out really good and once we're done cleaning downstairs I will make myself a cup of coffee and just kind of show you guys how it works. did do kind of an early fall clean and decorate video. If you guys haven't seen that, I will link it below, but all of the table decor is from that. So I am going to be putting this stuff away. I'm going to get Sophie's breakfast picked up and thrown away. Honestly, she just like throws a lot of her food on the floor or feeds it to Mickey. Um, but I do have to tell you all that she is walking, she's finally taking multiple steps and honestly I can't believe she's going to be one in just a couple weeks. So now we're going to get into the living room and I don't love having the playpen in here um, but that's the season of life that we're in and it's the only way that I can get a few things done. They say that Tom is free then why is it so precious? Oh, I'll save memories in my head Like Polaroids on walls They remind you to look ahead Time has run out
couch is looking pretty sad, so I am going to get it put back together. We have a ton of shoes down here, so I am going to put them in this little suitcase and carry them upstairs. And I have slowly been trying to work my way around the downstairs and clean the baseboards. And now I'm going to quickly vacuum and mop, which I could have used my little vacuum robot, but since it was filming day, I decided to um, vacuum and mop, but typically I would have let them do the floors. to the good days is to the sorrows if this is a mistake i know about tomorrow i don't want to fight no more because i don't feel the need no more no just want to make it stop maybe it's something in the water or maybe we just hit the end of the road right now it doesn't even matter it's too late first love and you were my first one cheers to all the memories the venom and the remedies yeah promise i won't forget Sophie sits in her high chair, there's always dried up strawberries underneath. All right, so the kitchen and living area are clean. Now I'm going to try to figure out how to make myself a coffee. I did get this um, coffee mug from TJ Maxx, and I always tell myself I'm not gonna buy coffee mugs because I have so many, but y'all, I really do love this coffee mug. And this whole like side of the kitchen is like the vibe that I'm going for whenever we move. I just love all these colors and I really have been loving this green color lately. Try, try. 
Now we're going to head into the bedroom, which is a little bit messy. I'm going to get everything picked up here and off of the floor, and then we're going to get the bed made. How could I be so stupid when I got all the signs? I guess that is love. Now the red flags are lucid, and I know that I'll be fine. I guess that is self-love. You think I'm going crazy, but I'm not missing you. I only miss the illusion you pretended to be. I'm not acting crazy, I just said we're through. Baby, you gave a lot. What about trust, trust, trust? What about all this time you looked in my eyes, babe? What about call, call, commitment? What about all the other last video I had talked about how we've had so many spiders here and something fell off the bed and anytime something moves I always freak out thinking it's a spider but it was actually just a feather. downy wrinkle release and I think it does a pretty good job. Been so nice having the kids back in school. I definitely feel like we have got a routine down um, and I've been trying to make sure I'm getting back to the gym or doing some like at home workouts which was kind of a struggle over the summer and I've been trying to like make sure I'm eating healthy and I've been um, still using the app Fastic. I partnered up with them um, a couple of videos ago, probably like a month ago, um, but it's for intermittent fasting, which is a really great way that if you're, you know, looking to, um, lose some weight, which I did still have some baby weight I needed to lose. So I have also been using that app, which is great for beginners and, um, they have like free option to track your intermittent fasting and I'll have my link in the description box below if you guys would like to check it out or if you're interested in fasting. So now we're quickly going to get into the bathroom. I'm going to clean the countertop, wipe it down, and I should have wiped down the mirror, but I did not have another uh, microfiber cloth towel to wipe it down. So we'll save that for the next video.
That's pretty much it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like, hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation, and thank you guys so much for being here today. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.